Hey guys, welcome to ScratchingFix.com and today I'm bringing a video on how to make a basic calculator. So without further ado, let's open up Scratch and let's import our costume. So for this reason, uh, calculator costume, I provide one in post. Okay, and now we're going to put in a uh, one green by clicked. Then we're gonna do ask what operate we're gonna type in what operation would you like to use? And then prompt them to use the multiply, add, subtract, and divide symbols. Next, we're gonna make a variable called operation. What this is gonna do, it's gonna tell our calculator what operation we're using. So, we're gonna make this, we're gonna make, we're gonna put in a set operation to answer. After that, we're gonna ask what what number do you want to use? Do the same thing, except we're gonna make another variable. I'm doing I'm gonna name this one number one. So then we're going to change this to number one. So then it will it will change the number to uh, the, the number one to the answer we put into for that uh, question. So now we're just going to change this to second. Now we're gonna make another variable. I'm gonna do number two. And set number two to answer. Alright guys, so after that we're gonna to wanna to make it equate the problem that we've given it. So we need if then else box. We need those to put them in there. And then we're gonna need equals. So we're gonna do if operation first, it's gonna, we're gonna do if operation equals add, then, then, yeah, uh, then we're gonna make another variable, okay? We're gonna make it output. We can name whatever you want. We're gonna need it. So the output is gonna be this the number one was number two with that equals. So we're gonna do set output to one number one to number two. So I don't want to remove this because it's pretty bad when it's not doing everything. Alright, number one, number two. Plus number one, plus number two. Then now the, the adding should work. Again, it's very basic, so. So one plus two. Oh yeah, I forgot, I didn't say it. I didn't say it, I said it to say it yet. So, I should say, say output. Okay, now it should work. Okay, let's do add one plus one plus two. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So after that, we're going to duplicate that. We're going to change this to minus. And if the, in the operation equals subtract, subtraction, 
then now subtraction should work. So we do subtraction one oops, subtraction nine minus one equals eight. Perfect works. Alright, now next we're gonna do multiplication and division. So I'm change it to multiplication, change it to division. And then I'm going to change this to multiplication, change that to multiplication, and then boom, you got it working. And if you want to, you can put, you can put uh, an error message saying not, not a given operation. So what this will do, it will, uh, Tell the person that the operation that they gave was not listed up there. There we go. All right, so now if we test that out, we can do do like eight, maybe, and three. Sorry, so you know, give an operation, you'll tell them that we can't that the operation here wasn't listed. Okay, so thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.